Today, we're adding some carbon fiber to the F80 seats. Hey, this is Brian. Thanks for watching Keys Motorsports. If you like our videos, give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe and check us out at keysmotorsports.com. Today, we're going to take the seats in this F80 M3 and transform them from this to this by adding carbon fiber overlays. Now, to do carbon overlays on your seats, it is an incredibly easy process. You only really need three things. You need some kind of molding tape. So we like to use 3M Extreme. We'll have it linked down in the description. We like to use 70% isopropyl alcohol, and you will need a microfiber towel. Now, the first thing that I already did off camera um, was I cut little strips of the 3M Extreme molding tape, and I already stuck it to the dry carbon. Now, with the 3M Extreme, it has an extremely strong hold. We use it to hold on spoilers and also front lips, so I'm not concerned that it's going to go anywhere. That being said, if you are using 3M Extreme, you don't wanna to use too much because it can be very difficult to get off if you ever need to remove these for whatever reason. So as you can see, I have a little bit of 3M Extreme installed. Now what we can do is take our alcohol and a clean microfiber towel, and then we're just going to clean the area where this overlay is going to be applied. And while I have it out, I'm just gonna do this side as well so it can dry. Then the longest part of the process, removing the backing from the tape. Once you've done that, we're gonna line everything up. And then just press it and hold it for about 30 seconds. And let each piece of tape stick. This looks amazing, look at this. It's just a little overlay piece, but check out how much it adds from just going from the matte black to the carbon. Wow. Wow. Now, same thing for the rears. We're gonna wipe this down with that 70% isopropyl alcohol. Now, the rear ones have a slightly different shape for the right and for the left, so if you try it and it doesn't really fit right, you most likely have the wrong one because when you have the right one, it should just pop right into place just like that. So once this has dried, we can start to peel the tape and stick it on. Now, I have tinted windows, so realistically, you're not gonna be able to see these unless the seats are folded down for some reason. Um, but if you don't have tinted windows, this looks so cool when you're looking through the rear windshield of your car, or if you go to a car show or something like that. And one thing you'll notice is that the carbon actually slides between the leather and the plastic. So you wanna push it in a little bit to make sure that everything is fitting properly. And as you just saw, this is a very simple upgrade. Seriously, the longest part of this is getting the tape off the backing. Once you stick them on, this completely changes the back seat of this car, it makes it look incredible. So once again, my name is Brian. If you are interested in any of the parts or tools or accessories we used in today's video, be sure to see the links down in the description. Once again, my name is Brian. Thanks for watching Keys Motorsports. If you like our videos, give us a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe and check us out at keysmotorsports.com. Thanks for watching and have a great day.